Sponsorship alert. This episode is sponsored by CWC, the podcast YouTube channel. Stop doing whatever the fuck you're doing and go subscribe now. Now on to the next episode of Cocktails with Cocktails. What up, though? It's another episode of Cocktails with Cocktails. Alessa is out. We miss you. Uh, we wish your loud, very boisterous voice was here. Uh, and I miss your energy and the nice things that you say to me off air because they are never on air. Uh, right now, I do have a beautiful guest co-host. They what call up, her. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I wrote it down. <laughs> they. What do they call you again? Self-proclaimed. The self-proclaimed. What else was it? Broke with the heated water park. Jasmine Daniel. Self-proclaimed. Broke goat with the heated water park. Yes, yeah. Jasmine Daniel, yeah. Black Girl Experience Podcast. You, I didn't even get to shout out my uh, handles on the last episode. You did. No, I didn't. You did. You literally Healing did. Healing my homies. No, I didn't. That was on you. That's all my shit. So oh, okay. Me on the so Twitter you you mentioned your throat. You mentioned like your pussy. What about your booty hole? What is that? Uh, is it like a song? Kind of off limits for real. You like, said you like a thumb in the butt. Yeah, but I don't really like anal though. So uh, that ain't my thing. You gotta have like a medium penis for that. Oh, okay. I agree. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like no, 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 no. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Not even gonna consider yeah. it. Yeah. So I'm gonna let my guests Probably. introduce themselves. Uh, but I want y'all to start off when y'all introduce yourselves, give whatever you want to give, your social media handles, your real names, whatever. Mm-hmm. Okay. But I also want you to tell me the position that makes you come the fastest. Okay. And boyfriends are included in this, sir. That's me. <laughs> Crying. All right, where we at, Ash? Oh, no. I was saying the first. All right, sorry. Mom, y'all, my sitters. But anyway, my name is Ashley, two E's. Um, Pull her mic back. Favorite position. Let's see. Def- you said, well, did you just say favorite position? You said no, position, position makes you, come, make you the come the fastest. Definitely riding. Mm. Yeah, Reverse definitely. or straight? Straight. Mm. Yeah, you riding like girls? straight. No, I actually don't like girls. Fuck. But I do definitely, you know, give girls their props. I love lesbian porn, but. Mm. So you wouldn't have a threesome with a couple that's married? You know what? I've gone back and forth about it. Like, sometimes I feel like I would, and then sometimes I feel like, do I really want to, or do I really, you know, like, I've been open to it. What about if they take you on a date and y'all have a good time? <laughs> it's going to be so fun. I promise it's, it'll be really so it. fun. Ah, but then I'm like, do I really want to? Story. Sometimes I feel like I missed that stage in my life. Like, I didn't, you didn't get, miss it. I didn't get a chance to do it. Like, damn, it's you almost s- like a wrap. You still alive. Yeah, black women live to be uh, on an average 86, <laughs> and I think you are far from that. So we can go on a, a date with my wife, like, next week. All right. Damn. You see what I did there? It was smooth. <laughs> it was. Yeah, you know, it, you got my back. It was the time. Yeah, it <laughs> Many was the time. worst times yeah. that that's been attempted. That was a better yeah. better version. Yeah. And then, honestly, good. if I was to even do that, I would probably, br- probably bring a woman into our bedroom mm. more than me, like, being going So, you would bring like, jazz in? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, see, I'm throwing alley you know. All right. Team player. You already Team know player. what you're doing here. You've Team been here player. 18 times. Not 18, but I mean a few. Yeah. I missed y'all. I miss yeah, you. I, I miss me. being back in the D. I miss you. You look like she lived in Miami, shit. okay? I, really? I yeah. love Miami. I mean, all right. You look I like a Miami and visiting a cold place. Yeah, Ooh. I left my coat yeah. in the place, okay. unfortunately. But it's like a good ass coat, so I was ready. But, anyways, that's not the point. Hey, y'all, hey, I am Nerdy and Nadia. Probably just gonna go by Nerd or Nerdia tonight, Brr. today, whatever. Um, but that's me on all my socials. I'm the creative engineer, engineer by degree, but creative by passion. You feel mm, me? Talk to him. <laughs> okay. Um, and I'm gonna say the same thing, but reverse. So riding, but reverse. Reverse, mm, okay. yeah. yeah. It's it's like, something about seeing them cheeks. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I feel but, you sexy feel like, absolutely. as hell. I just feel like <laughs> yeah. very, very, yeah. very sexy and in control, and I'm just like, yeah. Yes. Well, riding always gives me a break, stamina wise, and I can't come from riding. Hmm. Like it's very hard. It's something like how it touches my dick tip, where it it, it it's like a positive. Like it stops me from coming mm. when when I'm getting rode. I don't know. What Say it, it again, but differently if you could, because I'm really intrigued. So. Like, more words. It's like, I feel you though. I it's like you. how my dick is like roll, like reverse or regular. It's something about when I'm getting to that moment of climax, mm-hmm. how the the pussy grabs my dick, it, it brings it right back down. So oh. it's kind of like a um, when you're revving the an engine and it goes all the way to the RPMs, yeah. but instead it's not hitting that far RPM, but it's still hitting right, where it yeah. needs to go. So it feels great mm-hmm. because it's all. I think it's because my stamina is getting. Um, like it's your like muscles getting riding right. my dick Look. is like a sensu bean. If you watch Dragon Ball Z, it's like a sensu bean for me. <laughs> so it powers you up actually. You say what? It powers you yeah, up. Yeah, because I'm able to take a breath and relax 
and it's just my dick. Mm. Like, because sometimes we can come physically before actually coming from our dicks because we're exhausted. Mm -hmm. So it gives me a time to take a break and say, all right, cool, keep riding, Ashley. So, you know. Yeah, you. Yeah. You? Yeah, you know, I'm going to keep going with it. You been practicing. Yeah, I have, you know. <laughs> I'm so proud. <laughs> oh, so me now? My bad. Yeah. Man, I'm new to the show, man. That's my first time here. First time in the man, deep. First time a lot of firsts. Okay. A lot of firsts. Can you say what up, though? Can we hear you say that? What up? Like, what you want to say? No. What up, though? <laughs> what up, though? Tell them where you from. I'm from North Carolina. You're from North Carolina. <laughs> Anything about hey, yeah, he like, I don't know what what is the dough? Like, <laughs> what the fuck is going on here? All right, what's your name? Oh man, my name Kitch, man. If you're looking for me, Kitch Rodman, at sign in the front, dot in the middle. Okay. It's Cute a pleasure girl. to be here. Okay. We're nice and nice to have you. I'm fucking out of you. I mean, nerdy. Okay, yeah. Okay. I was okay. get it out. We'll get it out like again. We'll get it out. I'm fucking Because I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't even gonna come <laughs> in on that. Like, hey y'all, he be fucking her. That's why he like, That's exactly why. So I'm now here. I gotta go into the he story, said, that's right? That's exactly why I'm here. So yeah. I will admit energy. I do not allow boyfriends or girlfriends to come and sit in on shows. Mm -hmm. But Nerdia was smart and she hit me with it last minute. <laughs> no and me. so since she was coming from out of town, I assume, well, where else the nigga gonna go? No and plus she's also a podcaster, so I trusted her. Mm -hmm. And Kitch is cool. He thought it was about God. That was funny. <laughs> I brought my Bible and everything. Hey, man. shout out to God. Really? It's sex in the Bible. Okay. So technically it is. you know Hello. Yeah, we're not gonna is. talk about the things that have changed in the Bibles over the years. No. To make certain things not cool and all that I should do an episode on that. You really mm. should, but I should do more research because I don't want nobody that trying to catch well. me up. Mm. But that's neither here nor there. Put some disclaimers and shit. Yep, too. exactly. I don't know shit about Definitely. you, but I. But kids, you didn't say what what makes right, you come. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, oh, yeah, probably back shots for sure, man. Really? Hey. Okay. Yeah, for sure. It's just something about the back aesthetics. Shots, like <laughs> with, <laughs> with you standing up and her on the bed, or her. It don't really matter. It don't really. Oh, it's different levels of back shots. But to give me the most stamina, I got to be standing up. Like okay. I gotta get some leg support, you know what I'm saying? Mm. I also yeah. like doggy but. flat on the stomach too. Mm. Yeah. That's not that. Why did you yeah. steal yeah. my Stop, don't steal mine. Oh, oh okay. you like that? No, mine. doggy laying down is what if oh you if we God. that's the last position that we going into, because I'm coming. <laughs> I'm gonna come. I like to feel like, it in my stomach. Yeah. You know? Mm. You really? Mm -hmm. You ever any, any of y'all ever do anal? No. Mm. You ever do anal doggy flat like that? <laughs> Ooh, no, nah, I ain't never did anal flat. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. You no, think it hurt? Sound good. Yeah. Mm. But I could have. At the time that I was probably really doing it, I definitely could have. I think as a wild bag woman be like, yeah, I'll be doing anal missionary. I'm like, what? How? Like that? I try, but every time they be like, oh my God, no. Actually, funny. I have a video. I won't uh, play it. But I when I, uh, our first, was it our first time? No. Me and my wife's first time fucking, like, yeah, our first time fucking, uh, we had did anal. And it was Damn. this part. Um, <laughs> it was this part where I pulled it out, right? And you could hear the yeah. And then she, all you hear is like she grabbed. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it, yeah, it's like yeah. a very wild, funny video. I should low key piss her Not off. Of, you, got, you still got the video. <laughs> Not the sound. I, well, Wait, first of all, y'all was recording on the first. Y'all did a lot on the first night. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was our first, first time I'm trying. Sorry. No, 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 no. It wasn't our very first time fucking. Uh, it was I'm like, very, niggas. It was like our big time fucking because it was a hotel. Okay. Uh, so like, you know, hotel, you ain't got to worry about putting yeah. a towel down. Yeah. Yeah. You like get these shit stains out. Like it don't even matter. Like <laughs> fuck it. You know, you get the sweat. You know, hotel maids be pissed. What do you what do you call them? Housekeepers. I'm sorry, but uh, what did I say? See, Babe. I've been drinking. That's why I'm drinking. The I've been drinking. <laughs> but no, my mine is uh sitting down, like laying down, doggy. Like yeah. I love that shit. You grab the cheeks and it's just like I just go like really like power forward as fast as humanly possible. Mm -hmm. And that's what makes her squirt. So mm. interesting. Yeah. So I just haven't gotten that to the science yet. So when do you so you don't know how to squirt? I do, but only with toys and like assistance. I haven't been okay. able to do it like on a day. What about you, Ashley? I squirt often. All yeah. the time, like once I, I feel like she squirted it, this morning. Nah, yesterday <laughs> that for sure. Uh, yes, was a, it was a and good the day one. before. Sure. And the one day before. by yourself. Oh no, nah. oh, okay. definitely not by myself. Oh okay. Yeah. So who lays in the squirt? 
the West what? spot. We both. I mean, wherever yeah. we lay. I always got to sleep in the West spot. I always get forced in the West spot. <laughs> I'm like, why? Because it's mine? Yeah. Like, yeah. I feel you like y'all should You may like try to avoid it, but then you said, they be like, yeah, well, that's cool. Yeah, just stop caring at this point. I hate it. Hey, no, man, nigga, I be shivering at night. Like, <laughs> I'm saying, I'm cold. It cold. is I'm cold. cold. It's good. It's good. It's good. Like, cold. You got it. Like, I, I never realized how wet squirt could get until I was shivering in that shit. And then I'm I got, I tell you, I did a real nigga rig thing. I plugged up the, because it was, I was too tired to like go and get some sheets from yeah. the basement. So I plugged up the uh, <laughs> hair dryer. Oh my goodness. Well, it out oh, it took dry. two minutes, okay? That's a mess. And it was warm when I laid down, so I fell asleep like a baby. <laughs> it was That's perfect. Like you might be on some shit. Hey, look. I personally probably, probably would have grabbed the iron. You know, just a little. Damn. Like a steam, yeah. Don't you hate well. when you come up with a good idea, but somebody come up with some <laughs> idea that's common sense and a lot smarter? It's like, damn. I don't. I think both of I those are both not common yeah. sense. I, both weird. They're both some high shit. Yeah. yeah. Like, Dry I would, and personally, I wouldn't do that. But I, I mean, would just sleep without the sheets before I do all that. Yeah. That's yeah. a cold bed, man. Yeah, fuck that. I'd be <laughs> shivering. Change the like, sheets. Right. right. Change the sheets. So, blanket. Question. Y'all ever so, get a massage during sex? Like, during insertion of your vagina? Yes. Um, I feel like uh, I so, have, uh, That's yeah. a thing. It's a thing. I didn't know it was All a right, thing. All right, hold on. Let me hear hers. Nerdy, how was okay. you massaged? Uh, it was actually with a masked woman and a um, dildo. She had a mask on? No, no. Masculine woman. Okay. There we go. See, I, I de- it's fine. Um, no. See, that's why we, we here. We we educate. Yeah. Okay. Right. I actually knew, um, but I want you to educate my guests. I mean, my uh, listeners. Fair, fair. Yeah. Good job, good job. See? I'm yeah. so proud of you. Like, yeah. you know, I like you've been educate. growing and shit. You really want to <laughs> find out? Like, you have to think about listeners and guests. For sure. And like, we be talking about MMFs, and for all we know, Ashley don't know what the fuck we talking about the whole episode. Yeah. What is MMF? See, male, male, female, threesome. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And not I was a like, train. Stuff, you know, but just by not knowing by the technical terms, yeah. basically. Right? Yeah. yeah. So, I don't have a names for it. Oh, but we was in missionary and what? My knees are in my chest mm. and they were massaging my feet. That's how I like to get my ass ate. My God. Knees to chest. Yeah, that try is a kitchen, I'm telling you. Um, I've been hearing good things, man. Look, I've been I'm telling things. you. It tickled at first, but <laughs> yeah, when you get tickled. relaxed, like. You gotta like niggas know what it is. Like when you cool walking around the whole house butt ass naked on soft mode, then you oh, ready. Shrimp. You you ready to get your ass ate. Cause what <laughs> what else? Like niggas, she seen like it's I niggas that don't want to get their ass ate, but they let they they women wax them. Like it, it don't get more intimate than these levels here. I I think it's a hygiene thing, and no shame, no tea. I love you, and your hygiene is amazing so much. But I, I don't want to eat no man booty. <laughs> Why do you think we dirty? Cause y'all are, excuse me. <laughs> y'all dirty. Nah. Can be. We can't However, get cleaned up, like yeah. Like no, y'all be having like dingleberries and shit. No, we don't. I got a bidet. <laughs> you hair, do lots of hair. You do. Look, I Congrats. said catch the Amazon link. I Actually, think- give me the starter pack. How to get yeah. my ass eight starter? Look, pack JG here. low key. I don't know if he was saying like he think I sing or something, but he got me a bidet. Well, as my housewarming. Well. Yeah. Yeah, that's because he know. Maybe he know you, you a freak, on. so right. he was like, yeah. "We we go." I didn't this think guy. when he got it, he knew that I was gonna be using it to jack off with. Wow. So you have done that. Yeah. How is it? Same Great. thing as the shower, right? It's an innocent smile for me. <laughs> so I mean, you know, it, it's fun. I actually knew about it like before, like I was yeah. in Japan, and this was my first time ever seeing a bidet, and I was like, "Well, how does this work?" I pressed the button. I, whoa! I'm like, wait a minute, that. Well, I'm here, so you know, let's see what goes on. And I'm like, wow, this is great. So it's like, I do it like every remote office day of mine. Like, oh. so that's every day because he work from home every day. No, I don't. <laughs> you know, I was like, three times a week, you know. Okay. You know, yeah. So is there like a technical name for it? But day jack off? Maybe I don't know. Shit. Ooh, I should be like the inventor right. of the bidet jack off. Like, fuck it up. The bidet off. I'm just really impressed that that's your first bidet. time using a bidet and that's what you used it for. No, I, I was using it because I took a shit, but when it hit, I said, well, damn, since we here. But damn. Did you flush it first? 
So, um, <laughs> I don't, I don't remember. It. So, Jazz, you were saying something about you, you got a massage it, during back shots. Yes, that shit was amazing. It was amazing. So, like, like a back massage, a booty massage, like no, he was he was hitting it from the back, and I was like, but again, flat doggy on the mm-hmm. stomach. He was like, you want a massage, and I'm like, hell yeah! No. So he started massaging my back, mm. and was it? I'm like. You got that me wanting to pull amazing. out the massage gun now. Right? Yeah. It sounds like it feels good. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. I want that. I want, I that. want that. Yes. I want to do that. When was the last time that. you got massage, dude? Uh, that was like two, two weeks ago. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people try to have sex right before they come on the show. <laughs> I did. I wish I would have got that memo. What? Y'all ain't have out of town sex yet? My I thought mom we was talking was about here, God. I was in Bible study. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I like this dick. <laughs> Y'all really didn't have no Detroit sex? Bro, my mom was here. I said the same thing. What that mean? My mom was here but, in the Airbnb. Again, what that mean? But Okay, well, she's leaving, and then we can consummate everywhere. However, Wait, are y'all sleeping in the same room? No, nah, I'm on the couch. Yeah. Oh, okay. See, now, okay, so yeah, let's yeah, talk yeah. about that. Yeah. Because I... What, what I will say about podcasting, it has nothing to do with sex. What I'm learning is to deviate, if I can, from whatever I have pre-planned, if it's something that is... Uh, Interesting. Yeah. So, how does that work? I'm like, was that a conversation that you had with your mom? Or was this something that y'all so, pre-planned? Or I, avoided, I avoided the fuck out of the conversation because me and my mom have like a sticky relationship. And mm-hmm. I do not be telling this woman about... I almost say bitch, but not because she is a bitch, but just because I be saying bitch. Mm-hmm. So... Don't don't do me. But anyways, um, so I avoided that conversation because I don't be talking to her about like love, damn sure not sex and shit. And I am trying to fuck. But anyways, mm. um, so when she pulled up yesterday, I was like, all right, are you sleeping on the couch or in the bed? Because the opposite one, he gonna be sleeping in. So like, what's what's good? Mm. And then she was like, no, I'm gonna sleep in the bed. And I was like, all right, cool. Mm. And then that was that. So y'all, she didn't even say like like nothing about y'all. Or anything. Mm-mm. Was that your no, first time meeting? No, she was actually him? excited yeah. to meet him. Oh, okay. She didn't know that you were a he, so that was interesting. Mm. Mm. That was funny. How was that but conversation, by the way? Like about you equally liking women to date, just like men. Like, uh, uh, it wasn't much of a conversation with him because he's like has more common sense to like know that I'm fucking with who I'm fucking with. Mm. Not necessarily like, oh, I'm chasing dick. Oh, I'm chasing mm-hmm. pussy. It's like, I like you. D- so You're probably going to yell at me because yep. I'm using the wrong terminology. That's fine. I don't know the term terminology, so I like to be transparent with it. But you are what I would consider a, it's not a, when I say the word true bisexual, I'm not saying that it's false bisexuals out there. You're just yes. like the literal 50-50 down the split middle bisexual to me. Yeah. Because you're literally the person that I would think of that could literally go left or go right for the rest of her life. Thanks. Or like you could settle down with a man or I a woman. I like having options. Yeah, some women, <laughs> some women don't consider themselves like that. They consider, oh, I fuck other women, but I will only settle down with a guy. And some guys yeah. will say, I'll fuck other women, but I'll only settle down with a guy. Mm-hmm. So to me, they're not like a, um, like I'm saying, a true bisexual. Mm-hmm. Not saying that they're false, but they're not straight down the middle. Yeah, and it's like I feel like that kind of narrative is a little bit dangerous too because it's like. Like, in a little bit minute way, it's kind of, like, devaluing the relationship you could potentially have with whatever one you don't see yourself going forward with. It's mm-hmm. kind of, like, cheapening, cheapening that person and that your mm-hmm. relationship with that person. Because it's like, well, damn, you can't see me and you rocking this shit out. Mm-hmm. Why the fuck are you here right now? So, let me ask you this. Are y'all monogamous? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, to me, you're not even bisexual. To you, but what I mean by yeah. that is your kitsch set you at this moment because yes. y'all are in a relationship. So I don't get what people's issues are with people. Like some women say, I can't date a guy that's bisexual. And I'm like, well, don't you want a monogamous relationship? They say yes. And so what does it matter? You shouldn't be fucking nobody else, but you anyway. anyway. So, and even if it was, and y'all was open, but that's not here nor there. I'm right. here to defunct these stupid myths. I'm a yeah, myth yeah. buster here. So. Did you ever have an issue, like, with her being bisexual? No, no, no. Did you think, like, I could easily get a threesome because she was bisexual? Mm, I mean, she said that more than me at first. Well, Let's go back to that. <laughs> that sounds great. <laughs> she like, you know I'm bi, so, you know, we're the bitches. Yeah, like, yeah. Okay. How many threesomes have you had? Zero. 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 What? I haven't had any um, together. 
Wow. But y'all want to. I mean, yeah, I love group sex. Group sex is my You don't want to have a threesome? Oh, absolutely. I mean, but it's not like a pressing thing. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. So are y'all, like, looking for somebody? Because Jazz is single. <laughs> <laughs> when your mom leave? Today. Oh, you're not doing nothing tonight, right? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just throwing alley loops out there. It's just, whatever. Anyways, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Don't Nadia look like she eats some pussy? She do. I'm glad. I'm glad. Honestly, I'm like, we're hitting the nail on the head. Because I don't want to look like I don't. <laughs> I told you about my pussy eating contest, right? No. So, I was rapping back in the day. And so, I had these two girls. They were in my music video. And they were trying on the lingerie the day before. And so, somehow, we got on the conversation about who can eat pussy better. And so, one girl's like, well, I can be y'all fucking prop. And Oops. my dumb ass is like, I'll go first. That's a shit. porn Look, that I, I watch a lot, yeah. actually. It was a pussy eating contest. When I say I lost, it was <laughs> like, did you even pinch of the course, bitch? Of course, of course. Look, this is how, this is what happened. I'm eating her out, man. I, I, you know what? I should have did. I should have went with the fingers. See, I was young back then. Right. I even uh, ate her okay. ass. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh. I mean, oh. She was oh. like, I'm talking about the most. Mm, mm, got to that. Mm. Look, when baby girl went down there, she screamed. Ah. I'm talking about. <laughs> I was just sitting there like this. Ain't this a bitch? No. I even put my dick in her mouth and she ignored my dick. Cause she was so into getting hair from this girl. I left. They didn't know I left until twenty five minutes after I left. They called me like, where you go? I'm like, I mean home, man. I I, I mean home. Like that shit hurt. But you know what it made me the man I am today. And I, I hope it. you is eating the fuck out of your wife. Look, man, I love eating pussy. Pussy tastes so good to me. I don't it don't even have a taste, if that makes any sense, but it tastes good. Absolutely. A pussy not having a taste is it's a, a beautiful taste. thing. Yeah, yeah. Because if it got a taste, <laughs> I had fish before. Anyway, that's you know. Speaking of that, you ever was with a chick and she stank? She had a bad day. Um, no, I've never had hmm. that before. I the only like, I'll say kind of bad situation that I've ever or bad sexual situation that I ever had with a woman is this girl was like super duper 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 aggressive like she was scratching the fuck out of me mm. like she was biting me which I can be into right mm. but her nails were like super yeah, stiletto yeah, yeah, and just scratching just the fuck out of me and I was like girl I don't want mm. welts and shit right. like please please back the fuck up please so back the fuck up. I wish Alessa was here thank you to tell this story but Alessa had told me the story about this girl and she was like you would have thought she was a nigga because she was, like, munching on her pussy so hard. And I was like, did you tell her to stop? She was like, man, I told her, like, hey, you could ease up a little bit. <laughs> and, you know, she was like, you know, <laughs> women send signs where they kind of moving and shit. Yeah. And as a woman, I would expect her to get it. But she was just, I was like, maybe she was fried. Well, yeah. Because when we that. had our threesome, that was Tanisha's problem. That mm-hmm. she felt like we was both, like, munching on her shit. But when I say we was fried, I'm talking about <laughs> I was so out of it. Like, I only remember, you ever see the movies where the person blacking out and it's like, it go black. Yeah. Open up. Show you like, scene that's how then. I remember the sex that night. Oh, shit. Like, to this day. Like, I don't remember. I remember, like, damn, this bitch is wet. But I didn't realize it was blood. I thought this yeah, story sounded wars. familiar. Yeah, I got bled on in my threesome. My only threesome. Really? Yeah. All up in she the beard. Like, on her period? Or she started a period in the middle of a threesome. Like, she didn't say nothing about like, hey, I'm about to. Be. But did y'all? Did you care? Did y'all care? Oh, well, she Tanisa was pissed. So she she uh went. She left the room for a second. Mm-hmm. And when she left the room with the toy, she realized it was blood on the toy. Ran back and it was blood all over my face. It was blood all over the bed. And she was just like, damn. So she put me in a closet because I was so fried. She knew. If she told me, I would probably say some wild, reckless shit. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, wow, I'm in the club. I'm jacking my dick off and everything. I'm ready. Oh, well, that's I don't good. Know you, what y'all doing. you couldn't taste it or taste I was, the blood. It was just, when I say I was fried, oh, you was I'm fried, talking fried. if I scale it from all the times I've been drunk, like top two. And then I seen a girl walking out the room. I looked at the bed, white sheets in the Airbnb. I'm like, mm-hmm. who got shot? <laughs> nice. 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 Yeah, I haven't told the story. I, well, I haven't told the story in like a year. Now hey. that side. So yeah, I, I feel like I only tell the story when Nerdy come on the show. Hey. It makes it wild, yeah. But I don't think like the girl knew. It's just a fucked up situation. Mm-hmm. No big, big deal then. No big deal today. Like, and y'all could have definitely had brought her shit down too. 
Like she probably yeah. wasn't. Yeah, wasn't I had an ex call my dick like, Moses because I always brought her periods down. Yeah, wow. like yeah. she probably wasn't due for like a week. And that shit. Loki you know, is a nasty thing. She said I part the Red Seas now that I think about it. That's kind of yeah. nasty. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all ever have period sex? Not on purpose. Um, I have, but it'd be like light, like at the mm. last day. You suck dick? Yeah. Mm-hmm. On the period? Mm-hmm. So like Mm-mm. you be sucking blood off the dick? It don't be like blood though. It'd be like, oh, was it there? Barely there. Like I don't even have to wear a tampon. <laughs> so you barely so you barely like, I'm not a vampire. Even wearing a tampon that day. So you barely a vampire. Yeah. It's okay. like gone, but it's like really don't mm. need to be giving me head and mm. it might come down some, but like, oh, I've been good for the last couple hours. Okay. Y'all ever <laughs> get head? Like while on your period? Yes. If a oh uh, no nah. with a tampon. With a tampon in? No, like mm-hmm. that nigga was tasting that blood. Oh no. Nah. I did hear that women <laughs> yeah. you tell me if this is I've just false. I did hear that women are really into that. Is that true? Hmm. Nerdy? Some yeah. yeah. I think it's like it just depends on your like your period and shit. But I I have enjoyed it. It was gross and it took me a little bit, you know, to get over it, but it was fun as fuck and I came. So like I will say I did it once, but she had a really big clip. Mm. And she was really in the clip play, so mm. I wasn't really like in that thing. I got, I, we was drunk, out of town, so one, you know, you know. <laughs> fuck it. I love the movie Blade, so you know. Well, damn. Yeah. Yeah. Would you eat her pussy on a period? Ah, uh, light flow. Okay. <laughs> light flow. Like, you like know, the lightest of the flow. <laughs> <laughs> light flow. Men in North Carolina, they they, have, they ain't Carolina. say no to shit yet. Okay. Not yet. This king ain't say no to shit yet. Well, ain't no, no. I tried. Okay. I tried anything once. Really? Mm. Peggy? I said, I tried anything once. That don't mean I'm going to like it. That don't mean I'm going to... Ah. It's even going to go all the way to the end okay. of the extent of what that's we're doing. Sex? Nigga back there like, please get out my ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. God damn. You ever fought, try a finger pop? No, nah, what's that? A finger pop? You what's get that? your ass ate and then she pop her finger in there. I hmm. never ate his booty. I'm... I'm getting my ass in? Yeah. <laughs> nah, I ain't never got my ass in. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm just like, telling you. I'm just like, trying to, me? No. That's how you know it's a guy, because the closest I ever felt to heaven. I said, oh, shit. Jasmine. Just <laughs> Jasmine. Jasmine, you, you, would you eat ass? No. Me, booty? No, I'm not eating Look at her face. I, like I could tell she would never eat no, ass. No, I'm not like, disgusted. I feel like Ashley. But why not, though? Actually, I've never eaten ass. It's just the hygiene thing. I feel like it's fun to kind of fuck with y'all. Like, we give a head to kind of get kind of low, but then I feel like that's the bit. See, you're going to find a wrong nigga. I play with it and shit. You're going to find a wrong nigga be like, go lower. You like, oh, no, I done pushed some heads down before. I was like, well, you are you right there. They always pop right back I don't up. Get the they, always yeah. they always pop right back up. Yeah, I don't get why you want. It. So even if the nigga just got waxed and took a shower with you, you wouldn't eat his ass. It probably not. Respectfully, you're sexist because you eat women's asses. No, no purpose. How you mistakenly Ooh. eat ass? I love looking because at booty holes, so pussy? I know when I eat them. Okay, okay, mm-hmm. okay. Mm-hmm. Eating it from the back. Is like, your tongue that long? Eating it from the back, huh? Is your tongue that? Mm-hmm. You knew what you, <laughs> okay. you, like, knew what you was doing. I, I like I ain't buying it. See, I'm, I'm with him. Oh well, like it doesn't really matter. So, um, but I like giving head, like thoroughly mm. and a lot, and yes, to all the sexes. So awesome. whatever. Is that 27 minutes, Trev? Yeah. All right, we got time because I, I want to get in some new shit that I just thought about. Hmm. Well, what type of woman would y'all like for a threesome? Mm, that's an interesting question. I know he's going to be so cool, so I'm all into this. I'm uh, ready. I don't think we have... I don't even think we've had, like, the conversation of yeah, what type of... Or if we like the same type of women mm. and yeah. shit. What type of women do you like? For I reasons? like ass. Mm. And obviously pretty and nice and, and the, the things, but... Isn't she gorgeous? <laughs> anyways. <laughs> he's funny. Um, <laughs> he's funny. <laughs> But yes, I feel uncomfortable watching her videos. She do workout videos. Oh my god! And she made me. I felt so His bad. Ass too. I felt so bad. You she do? was like squatting and shit, yeah. and I was like, okay, I see you with the traps. And she deleted the video. No, that Ashley was with deleted. my voting one. No, oh, that was the voting she one. She put on her thick ass thigh. No, I had put my. I I voted sticker on my thigh, and I had did a boomerang with that, and he mm-hmm. thought I was doing the most, so I took it down and did one of like this. I did not say you was doing the most. I um, said, okay, I see you trapping. Oh, I was trapping. I'm like, yep. I really was being innocent, but I do trap in the gym mm. for sure. Hey, I don't like when y'all do the videos it's when y'all do the squats it's fun. and y'all cheeks I'm be just point, gonna be doing me out. like, I, but it's I actually know ass. what I'm doing. I actually love working out though, so it's like I feel like why not pop my shit because I exactly. actually enjoy that shit. What's the respectful way for a man to acknowledge your trap? 
without making you uncomfortable or should he not acknowledge it at all? I feel I, like just always be yourself, but yeah. don't try to act like, you know, you not being one way and you are. Like, just be raw. And I'm married, it. so I just put fire emojis. That's pretty yeah. safe, I guess. Yeah. Or I've been known just to just call straight out. I've been heart. like, this is yeah. the first trap ain't it? Like, like, yeah. like, when I see, like, ass and titties and shit, like, I just feel like I'm, like, not doing something per se wrong, but teetering lines where I'd be like, okay, big ass titties. Like, okay. unless I, like... I'm like you're my friend and you're like okay, my close yeah, friend yeah. or some shit and my wife have a relationship yeah. where if she saw my phone I don't believe in going through phones don't go through phones I'm completely against that but if my phone was laying there and she saw that it wouldn't be some shit that would upset her mm. so like example Ashley it would be a clap or a fire emoji or if she put me in her close friends I seen a booty hole I would put a shocked face <laughs> no I do that like girls and the close friends when they put wild shit I just put a shocked face yeah. I'd be like do y'all have close friends I do but oh, I never hate when people guys. got bullshit and they close friends yeah. well, I hate that shit I don't people know if I had bullshit and they take this shit out of here what is this the same thing they post on their regular yeah. story but you know what like it is? a little so bit more it's, close it's friends. four niggas that can't see it yeah my close friends is only my close friends cause I what you posting there Everything I want to, everything I want to post in there. They didn't seen more than probably my nigga didn't seen. Like, really? and I don't have a nigga right now, but like wow. I posted my close friends, so I just cleaned up my close friends. I mm. took a lot of bitches out. Cause mm. I'm like, yeah. you so I can't be there? myself and be raw. Then no, what you in there it's for? It's like a four nigga max in my shit. Oh, exactly. so it's I'm weird. not gonna say no names, but somebody had me in their close friends for two months, mm -hmm. and they forgot they had me in there, and I was like, <laughs> I don't want to say shit. Because I don't want them to take me out. <laughs> and then one day they took me out and I cried. No. Oh, so how did you know? Because I was just talking about that. Like, how you did you know you were no taking out? Right. Because I never seen right. it. Nerdy had never posting their close friends ever again. <laughs> oh, that's because you were posting some, like, Instagram dare shit or oh, whatever. Oh, I did dare And you dare while. me to show my ass. And I was like, I'm not doing that on the whole internet. But I put it in the close friends. Mm -hmm. And he was like, okay, but how am I going to know that you did it? And I was like, I'll just add you. I added him for two days. No, or, I was no, it was, two months. Months. it was like two months. <laughs> I was like, I was like, damn, I don't want to look at it because she gonna see I seen it. <laughs> like niggas and her close friends were like three times a week, and then it just went away. I was just like, damn. Damn. <laughs> yeah, my, I'm in my close friends like daily. Maybe I'm petty. Mm -hmm. I be noticing Same. when people take me out. I be like, I am too. Not I fucked the what nigga. Did I he do? took me out his close friends. I'm like, damn, I ain't gang no more. Damn. No. <laughs> no. I'll be taking Ew. people out, though. I'll be taking people out. If you don't participate, never, I'm taking you out. Yeah, if you never really on social media, it's like, why did yeah. you? Oh, and that's exactly. another thing. Like, I participate. I, I part, so I like to participate in everybody's shit. So mm -hmm. if I see a story, I like to uh, be a positive person. Mm -hmm. Even if it's uh, you cooking. Oh, that's dope. What's he, what did you season it with? Uh, if it's some crazy shit. Oh, that's dope. You know, if it's some wild shit for sex, you know me. Come on the show. Mm -hmm. You know, what's up? Right. You know, whatever it is, I'm all for it. I'll even admit right now, I'm drunk and I had nothing to do with the soliloquy. <laughs> but I needed awesome. to let y'all know. I'm high yeah, as that's hell. Great. My high is coming down a little bit. So this thing is so cute. Yes. Oh, I can smoke it here? Like smoke no, smoke here? But no, you outside. Smoke outside. Oh. Is it snowing still? You be smoking? Probably. Huh? Why you say it like you this? Smoke you smoking? Yeah, I smoke. Boy, boy. You don't always smoke. You don't be smoking. Yeah. I don't think I so. I smoke to go to sleep before I go in the office the next day so I don't uh, stay up too late. Hmm. Yeah, and I'm a social smoker. I got my weed pen. Can I hit that? Yeah. No, yeah. okay. But what I did smoke the joint. You, you, you got some gummies? Days? You usually have some gummies. It was like in the morning and I before. I don't have no gummies on me. Somebody but I do have always a lot got of some gummies. So, Ashley, you be fucking I niggas. just was working in cannabis. Huh? Uh -huh. The same nigga? Mm -hmm. Right now it is, yeah. Oh, okay. Y'all just fuck buddies? I'm being very nosy. You know what? <sighs> I wouldn't call us fuck buddies, but basically we are fuck buddies. Okay. You be fucking niggas from the gym? No, gym is off, gym, off zone. Mm. I've tried that. Mm, nigga <laughs> fucked it up. And I'm just like, you know what? The mm. gym is like my piece. I go there to Wu Sa, I mm. tap in, I myself. <laughs> I just don't even want to be awkward like a run in that just yeah. didn't make sense and now we got to just act like we don't see each other and I yeah. did it and it was yeah. awkward and I don't go to that gym no more thankfully mm. but mm. I wouldn't nah. So let's talk about this working out that you be doing. Yes, like, I think you, I'm you like working work out on the day. No, that's who. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, Ashley works out. Like she is. You got me stand up and demonstrate. Yeah, yes. Ashley. <laughs> okay, cause show the you girls know, that you know, know what we got to do. Show the girls what we got to do. Demonstrate oh, yeah, from I'm, the back. From the what you want to see? From the side, all of mm -hmm. squatting is good for riding. Yeah, squatting is great. You look like yes. that. You look like the TV when you turn to that channel. You ain't. It is like shh. I love this show. Yeah. Do it again. Can you do that again, but in front of Nadia? We'll do what? The squat. Yeah. Trying to make you gay real quick. <laughs> I'm not gonna be Your gay. form is amazing. 
Thank you. Hey, but do you see how I alley oop niggas? <laughs> I'm Chris Paul. You Chris Paul out here. I, I was just about to say. You really Chris Paul. Dead oh. ass. Am I not Chris Paul? Oh, I, I have alley oop. Mannerism with dick and pussy. What is that? Hookah. No, it's a I've only fell thing. twice. Is that a breeze? No. Mm. Oh, okay. Don't do me like that, bro. Look, don't look. don't do me. <laughs> I'll be honest. I'll be going in on all my friends with these breeze pins. I'm so rude. You should. This is a ooze. I, my oh, parents, oh, good thing they don't listen to it. I did a, a lung cancer uh, science like fair project in sixth grade. Do you understand how boring a lung cancer science fair project is? <laughs> I did that shit with the lung, how I don't breathe and shit. Mm-hmm. My mom was like this, okay? <laughs> oh, that's nice. <laughs> I, was, I was just like, fuck my life. Like, I was dead ass before the super bad movie when my man said, fuck my life. That was literally me and shit, great. I'm like, this shit ain't help for shit. My god mom stopped for a week and my dad stopped for a month. Mm-hmm. I think. He was smoking a, I don't know, but <laughs> hopefully they stopped one day. Um, what was you t- what we talking about? Oh, no. I like this right here. You mentioned that you like to hear and watch reactions when you have doggy style sex. Hey. Yeah, Ashley, you be fucking the mirrors and shit? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely in mirrors. Mm-hmm. I like to record myself a lot. I record myself a lot at home. I feel it, though. I, I'm definitely the girl that love to send a, a ton of attachments. I love to, like, oh, okay. shit. Oh, that's, 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 that's that. Yeah, I love that okay. type okay. shit. Yeah, me and Amir I go to my close friends. Well. How do you get really? back on your yeah. shit? Like, have you ever fallen off? Oh, I and, like some shit. So how do you get back? <sighs> I just enjoy the moment that I'm in. Like, once I acknowledge, like, dang, like, you just really ain't been on your shit. Like, I have to acknowledge it and accept it and embrace mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. And after that, it's like, you know you'll be good because you're going to snap out of it. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, so just what, are, what are these reactions that you hear and watch during Doggy Style? So, what? I said that? Yeah. Yeah, you no, did. You said Nadia said that. No, you said no, that. You said you like seeing their faces. I do too. I, but I oh, as well. yeah. I I okay, I'm like, I'm like, wait, I thought you said her name, though. No. No, 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 no I was just reading it. Oh, okay. Um,. So, with me, it's just more so, like, I know I got a fat ass. So, I just like to, like, I just like looking back. Yeah. Okay. You know, just seeing the reaction. Mm-hmm. I, like, you know, I do, too. I like ghetto hairstyle sometimes so I can you know, swing. <laughs> What's your yes, favorite? Little pool interest, action. Bro. Yeah, you know, I just like to, like, really get aggressive with it. Just You like to you gotta perform. Back. Yeah, I love yeah. throwing the bag. I love, like, high arches. I had a nigga that was obsessed with just high arch for the back. That's the only mm-hmm. position we did. Like, really? That's a good stretch, have, would, though, too. Like, like sometimes yeah. I would want to ride, and, you know, everybody, he, like, the so, arch. So, with you working out so much, do you mm-hmm. feel like it's built up your riding stamina? I feel like I always love to ride before working out. But mm. building up my stamina, no. I think, no, nah, my thigh is still going to burn. Mm. It's still going to get tired. Just like doing a squat, mm. you know, it's still going to get... <laughs> tired but no nah, i feel like just overall stamina how long um before you get tired on top though mm. not long because i'm a i'm a i'm a beast like i'm a champion i'm a th- i'm a thug it out Good could you ride dick for this entire episode like yeah i would find no. a way to definitely do it no way. i can show y'all my phone right now i can show y'all my phone text we need message room. right now we need because i was just talking about like damn i can't you believe we you was could, talking for three so hours you yeah, know i could no i really could so I, I have you will. Sunday We're too. waiting on the footage. <laughs> Sunday too. I ain't gonna show the footage. I'm mean, gonna the text. I will show a text. I was just talking shit about that. Oh, mm-hmm. God. Mm-hmm. you got the wrong ones. I'll show y'all. I'll I'll show they booty hole on this on the show, okay? Because oh, I will talk about the show. Ain't nothing off limit. I never forget that was the first time Trav ever showed the emotion. Was when she showed when the guest <laughs> showed her. He said, "That's crazy." The camera was shaking oh, yeah. and everything. Yeah, for sure. Is this only for women to see? No, you can see. Oh, all right, all right. We just talking about we was having sex for three hours. Yeah, three again, hours. I and, yeah. <laughs> I'm right here. It's a, it's a I still want to read she it. You want the footage out loud? <laughs> we want the footage where it didn't happen. How you feel about doggy style? Doggy style. When is the doggy style? I love doggy style, love but doggy like style. you can't just. You can't be sloppy with it. Because, mm. like, I have back problems. Man, I know somebody with, with that name. People, when people people you do you doing that name? Correct. It's plenty of people with that name. That's you don't hair. follow me, I hope. I say, you can't be doing this shit sloppily. Like, if you're going to mm. stretch me out, plenty stretch of people me with that out. Name. Mm. And don't play with it. Because, like, like, yes, we can go slowly, but also, like, get in, get into it. Mm. Yeah, I like, like that yeah. balance during sex. A little rough, a little wild. Mm. But I like I like a lot of passion in my life. Do you like slow? Yeah. Do you like talking? Yeah. you like getting slapped? I like getting spitty on my own. I, I haven't don't. had that, I, but I, I feel actually, like I would. I, I feel like you. I'm a spit bottom. I mm. like to get my mouth spat in. I love when she drizzled that spit in my mouth. Mm-hmm. Just her, though. Like, I don't think I would want anybody to spit in my mouth. Mm-hmm. I'll say that the sex that I have with my wife, like, not on no gay shit, but mm-hmm. like, 
not literal gay word how would it gay be? shit, oh, okay. but like on some cute like oh, oh like, okay. but okay. like Thank with my wife that. I feel like I'm willing to let her do shit with me mm-hmm. that I feel like I wouldn't be comfortable to do with anybody else I got you that's, so that's when she drips with that spit in my yeah. mouth it's just like like when she <laughs> do like in my kid. booty hole like it, it's mm-hmm. like it's perfect okay you said what how it make you feel I feel good no like, you got you did a dance oh yeah like she, <laughs> she melted me and honestly I feel like that was the most nut that's ever come out of my dick in my life mm. thank god mm. I put a towel down do y'all know what milking is no so like you're bent over like a cow oh. and like she's milking the dick but when okay. she did it she was finger popping me oh, so yeah. I was just like like it, I couldn't breathe like uh, honestly this is breathe. my first Alessa always says it I miss you bro Alessa always says it but uh, when she she says when she orgasms she can't hear and I feel like it was an outer body experience, and I was just sitting there watching myself, like you nasty you motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Damn. And I came, yeah, and I just kept coming. She's like, "Damn, nigga!" I was like, "Oh, oh you know." Yeah. She said I kind of growl like when I have sex. Like, yeah. Actually, I'm gonna call and ask her how I sound when I fuck. She's not gonna pick it I up. I miss her. Yeah. I hope I get to see her before I go. Yeah, we might have an orgy tonight. Y'all want to come? Absolutely. Well. <laughs> Okay. I fuck with this <laughs> hey, drink like, did he really say that? Let me make sure. She's not gonna pick That's up. That's why I like him. He be with it. Come on, baby, pick up. She don't never pick up. See, you called it though. Yeah, I did. So why she not picking up? All right, she not gonna pick up. Then she gonna call back right after the show. Uh, I, all right. So where we at, Trav? Spinning mouse. Forty minutes. <laughs> Yo, you back? What oh. you say? Well, I, oh, where no, we at? I got naughty. I put down nerdy of boyfriend questions. Oh, oh. Minute. all right, thanks. What's your favorite thing that she does sexually to you? Um, mm. she don't know she be doing it, but she play with her eyes, bro. She give me like these looks of like innocence mm. sometimes. Mm. Like I don't even know why I'm here, mm. and then she will give me these like fierce looks, like mm. nigga, I'm fucking your ass up, and I know it type mm. shit. <laughs> I just be like, cause I'm a looker, man. That's why I like missionary. I like, I like yep. to see yeah. the emotion. Like, you know, what I'm, saying? I'm a passionate lover myself. Yeah. So it's like, yeah. that's all. Like, when it get passionate, I do watch passion porn. Like, three I type three that months? in. Like, dope, dope, wow. Dope. How long like, you know each other? Like four months. Oh, yeah. I got in there quick, but I don't play no games. Time out. Time out. Time out. Let's go back to this. Y'all both from North Carolina. Facts. Oh, you're from North Carolina. And y'all only known each other for four months. I thought this was like a friendship that evolved. No. No. So how did y'all meet? March. I did not know who she was. Facts. So how did y'all meet? At the airport. Ah. Who got on who? Yeah, who crossed you? Uh, It was like, I was looking for an Uber, and it was the same car she was in. So I actually just got in a car. What? Thinking it was the Uber. And then you jumped out? She was like, she was playing it cool, but like, who the fuck are you? I ain't getting no share shit. Oh, I get it. Like, (laughs) So did you get in the Uber? Then I was like, well, who car I'm in? Like, So was it an Uber ride? Huh? Was it an Uber ride? Yeah, Yeah, from the airport. Oh, so you know. stayed in the car? No, no, I ended up getting my, my Uber eventually, but but so you the stayed Uber, there long enough for me. So, to the, so, so the Uber driver was like, "What the yeah. fuck's going on?" And you got on. I was hot. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I just knew it was a jeep. Got in so, the jeep. Wait, it's and a it was Uber open jeep? too. That's like a cool the, little connection. The door was open. Yeah. The door was open. Yeah. Yeah. Open. It was my it's, jeep. It's giving. Yeah, it was her jeep. It was her car. Yeah, it was my jeep. So you was the passenger. So time out. Hold on. Let's rewind. So you was at the airport because you was waiting on my friend. So let's talk about how hot this nigga is to think that somebody with a Jeep Wrangler is gonna actually be. And you know my Jeep be having hella shit. Not just that, but the gas mileage on the Jeep Wrangler, nigga. Nobody's Ubering in that bitch. No one. And honestly, the being like a Grand Cherokee, <laughs> that's even funnier. So, what did you? Was you annoyed at first? Yes. What? Like a stranger, a stranger got in my. Hey, look. At I what been, point hey, was you hey, like, hey, okay? I would have been like, I would have been like, hey, what the fuck, bro? Like, I would have had my hand on my shit. Get the fuck out my shit. All right, but you know I'm not that person. I, look, she was probably just too scared. Like, oh, shit. Like, or like trying to, like... I feel like a woman was, would be frozen. It was, like, yeah, like, that's what it was. I'm trying frozen. to talk to her, like... like you know, I'm, I'm hey, a calculating driver, ass bitch, like, so I was right. really like, okay, okay. And you got in the you got in the back. Yeah. Oh, man. That's even funnier. It was crazy. I was like, this is... this. Was you in North Carolina? No, I was in Miami. 
even funnier that y'all from the same spot. Right. I feel like y'all should have a kid now. Nah, like, this is perfect. Damn. You know what I mean? Kid or married, Can I have man? some time? No. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Wait, can't you younger, go though. fucking first, nigga? Damn, you married and shit and live with your beautiful ass wife. You know wife. what? I get it. I get it. Dogs. Let's change Might the subject. Might as well. I'm with you. Let's change the subject. Correct. All right, my mm, bad. Don't do okay, that again. Wait, so at what nah. point was you like, damn, he fine as hell? Or yeah. like, at what point was it like, oh. Um, so on. me, myself, I also am a heavy smoker. So okay. like, it took a second, but <laughs> I like hopped out my shit because I'm thinking it's my friend and I go around to the other side and I'm like, <laughs> you're Who's a this nigga? straight, you I was don't know you. That was high, sir. Too. Yeah. You huh? was picking up a male friend? friend? <laughs> no. Oh. No, it wasn't. So you were yeah, fried. Both was okay, some cool. Shit. Makes yeah. sense. That's, that's cool. some hot <laughs> shit brought y'all together. That's, yeah. that's, that's, that's I think the whole shit. altercation would have been different if the door was locked. Because they don't have yes. been like, oh, <laughs> right. Mr. So, Uber driver unlocked the door. Wait a minute. This is not my Uber. Right. Take right. a step right. back while right. I'm outside the car. So but. did y'all hang out while you were in town? Not that time. Mm. Okay. So you went back. Mm-hmm. Wow. So you want to get home. hit her up when you got there? So or I like want to say shout out to Josh's kid. Uh, exchange okay. numbers the first time. Because then he when he came it. back. Yeah, he planned it when he came back for my birthday. So, when is your birthday? Cool. August 25th. So can we at? talk Virgo. about the Virgo. game that you okay, have to have to pull this off? <laughs> that's game. Yeah. You was in an airport outfit. Yeah, I wasn't feeling that. Yeah, that's Bless. fits matter on the airport for this reason. And do you in an airport I'm outfit? I'm an airport outfit girl for sure. So look, I'm wearing sweats. And I'm I'm not, it's gonna be a cute I'm sweat. Not, I'm, yeah. not, I'm gonna be stepping in my sweats. Places. All right, and I'm it's taking gonna, shots. But it's gonna be cute, casual. Yeah. I'll be in my Crocs. Yeah. Maybe even a beach shirt from last day. night. Comfortable as hell too. Period. That's wild. So I'm still comfortable. You was just in town. I had a cut though, so it was like okay. It don't matter what I got. I'm a barber's daughter, so so let me ask you this. Because y'all met, I'm assuming like the first time that y'all hung out, y'all fucked, right? Yeah, for sure. Because it was my birthday. Gonna wait, okay. Damn. It was my birthday. Say the sex was what? Who can say that? No, I'm saying like that would have been a fucked up birthday if the oh, sex was yeah. like, Well, she said that a couple times though. She was like, "I'm kind of glad this was a lot better than." Did y'all talk about it prior? Because y'all had to know prior, what was happening. Yeah, was wow. it a lot of sexual tension between y'all? Yeah. Yes. Y'all was probably sending videos and shit. Us. No. You ain't sending no pictures. Not really. Nah. Yeah. I don't remember doing that. No. Not before the first time. Mm-mm. Wow, you just met her mom. Mm-hmm. So when you going to North Carolina to meet his family? Well, I'm going to North Carolina to my grandma's house for Thanksgiving. I don't mm. know if oh. his family's going to be there though. I don't for Thanksgiving. think they will. She probably won't meet him until like Christmas time. Yeah. yeah. Probably. So Ooh. it's it's um rather quick. So whatever. Cool. It's fun though. So like I fucks with it. This is gay. It's fuck. So you know what's weird is I use gay in a different terminology like, yeah i don't really but i also it. am very gay so like yeah, i like it's it wild because both so now we got to set y'all with a threesome probably i mean i can whatever <laughs> like, oh let me ask you this josh if she wanted a threesome with you and another guy what would you do you say you would try everything yeah, I try. once that's right would you be down it, with it probably wouldn't be like that. oh i found this guy let's do it right now hold on let's put the brakes yeah like, how let you me, find that nigga yeah like let, let me settle into this so my wife wants one right yeah i don't think i could be hard for it you and that's why somebody, i want one y'all wasn't on the last episode but i was just telling the last episode i've never seen anybody else have sex porn included i mean that don't count. okay like in just, person i've never seen she gonna let you pick the guy I would look. I told her I was like, look, I'm not one to want to take away from what you want. Mm-hmm. I would prefer you go to Vegas and you pick two white guys, and I never hear about it. And I know that you well, got you your fantasy. You already talked about white people in the last episode. Them niggas yeah, down bad. I ain't telling her I wanted great. I, I, you know, I wanted to get some mid threesome. You know, not I no. Be phenomenal. Like, oh man, that was the best sex not I ever had. And I'm just sitting there threesome. in the corner pissed. <laughs> like, <so. laughs> like, if I have an MMF, I wanted to be at least. Well, both dudes got to be at least by because I like watching sex and I like mm. I like the participation of all parties mm. involved and I don't want anybody. Could to you be see your nigga get pounded out? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Ashley, I like. Could you see it. your nigga getting pounded out? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Could you see? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Could I you see yourself getting out. pounded out? No. I'm I not can. gay. What you mean? <laughs> <laughs> you cannot be gay and like. Dick and a booty. Wait, wait, wait. A real dick? No, no, no. Kind of uh, oh, like peg? Yeah. No, I just like a finger. Oh, okay. It's like the warmth of that finger. 
Hmm. And I think it's her fan. That matters, bro. Because yeah. dildos be cold as a bitch. Wow. They ain't put them in the microwave? I'm afraid it would melt. But Somebody like, told I don't me that that's what, that's what they do. And I've asked every lesbian that, and they all look at me like, where the fuck did you hear that? <laughs> but what they did confirm for me is that some studs wear the fucking strap around. Yeah. Okay. So it's yeah. I mean, to be honest, I'm not going front and act like I wasn't so desperately in love that I asked that of my stud partner at the time because it turned me on because I knew the stud was going to come mm. and do what it needed to do. So like, I want to ask you about a partner. Uh, I don't know how you can ask me without saying her name. All I'm gonna say is I didn't know if you were dating a stud or not. I was for a little bit. No, when I saw I I, I'm trying to think of a way to say this. I didn't know if it was a stud or, or a guy. Yeah, yeah. I was just like, I think very non-binary actually. Yeah, I agree. I know. It was that, so literally, I'm telling you, this was me on every post. It was so interesting. I'm like, you know what? Let me screenshot this zoom in. Because you don't know. Is that Peach for us? Like, yeah, it was. I was so, I'm like, maybe that's baby here. Maybe maybe he in the army. Baby. Maybe he just got out. Maybe uh, he in the army. I didn't know. Like, I was really confused. And then how the fuck you respond to somebody? Hey, is that a, is that a nigga? Right, don't do that. Like, that's wild. Exactly, like, don't do that. Yeah, you just take gotta a sit note. there shut and, the and take, you gotta shut the fuck <laughs> up. You gotta take a note and know Ashley can ride some dick. Like, it's is. just how I go. So, we, so I want y'all to give a tip. And okay. I want y'all to give a tip on how to give head. Like, your best practices on giving head. And then, Josh, I want you to give a tip on the best practices that Nerdia uses when she gives you head tonight. We're going to start with Jasmine. Because yeah. I was going to say, That's I got happen. mine. I she look like that, the gobble um, gobble here. I know. I'm trying to learn something. Yeah. I think that breathing is very important when sucking dick. Mm-hmm. Um, and I don't breathe. like... I don't like for a man to grab my head because, you know, niggas get excited. They be trying to do too much. That's why like, you got mad at me when I touch your bridge. <laughs> well, niggas be trying to do up. too much. And, <laughs> you know, I got my breathing set up for how it needs mm, to be. Because, mm-hmm. again, you don't get to your point where you about to deep throat. You know what I'm saying? I don't need you banging on my, like, because I got to have my breathing right. But mm-hmm. the head is phenomenal. Can they you know fuck your mouth? You can, yeah, but oh, for the most I part, like, I, I like to be in control of that. Like, right there, right. Yeah. Right. sex is a big ego thing for me. It's I like mean, a competition. Yeah. So, I, man. All right, Ashley, you said you love sucking some motherfucking I dick. I do, I do, I do. When so, was that time you sucked I dick? I do, I do, I do, I do. Yesterday, when, when I had the three, the sex, I just want to hear long. you say it. My bad. Yeah, yesterday. yesterday you sucked some dick yesterday. Yeah. You could tell she be leaving the lipstick on the dick. Yes, yeah, she do. <laughs> I do, yeah, it is. Trash, Which one you be using? Do you use specific lipsticks? Why she tell me about her sucking dick? Mm-hmm. But it, uh, it's it's whatever. Just whatever in the moment. Mm-hmm. But that's, that's... So what's your tip? So my tip is, you know, learn your guy. You know, mm-hmm. I can't say go in with sloppy because every guy may not like sloppy and wet. I'm being sloppy. I don't mm-hmm. want it to be, like, so much spit that I'm disgusted. Yeah. Uh-huh. And then, yeah. Some I said, niggas like, cool like, with that. Yeah, learn your that's, guy. So that's, I think that's, like, the biggest tip. Learn your guy. Um... Stamina, because mm-hmm. some niggas head could be, you know, where I can't come from head, and so you'll be there all night. Yeah, Must be nice. and then some niggas <sighs> gonna, Must you know, nice. do what it do quick, and it's exactly. not, it's not like ego, more so like, damn, this nigga ain't coming off my head. It's right. more so like, <laughs> that's what his body. Where do you want him to come at when he comes from head? I mean, I'm thinking in your braids or your scalp, wherever, like wherever it happens. Like we, we, I like, I'm a very sexual female. I like to be in the moment, so I just mm-hmm. like to let things happen. Um, I have a very sexual appetite. I'm a very sexual female. Like, just because I haven't dabbled in different sizes don't mean I'm... So I like to enjoy... It has to be a safe place with whoever I'm having mm-hmm. sex with. When was the last time Damn you had come on your face? Mm-hmm. Last time I come on my face... Uh, it's actually been a minute, unfortunately. You got some good skin, <laughs> so I'm just curious. Unfortunately, it's been a minute. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now I think about it, it has been a minute. Text but, him right now. Can you come on my face tonight? Because I want to see the reply. Okay. Triple dog dare you. <laughs> He's like, girl, you know I work. Cool. It's so funny. He gonna nah, know that I'm talking about it because we just he he just nah, texted me. Actually, I mean, just, just, about yeah. that. You said text what again? Can, Can I you come, come on my face? face tonight? Can you come on my face tonight? Yeah, please. Nadia, Daddy. what's your tip? Oh shit. Um, hmm. Shit. You said breathing. You said know your guy. Stamina. And stamina. Oh, I wanted to say like have a plan for your shit. Mm-hmm. Like know how you want to attack it again in a different time because that for me helps me to like control my breathing mm-hmm. and con- and like mm-hmm. read him at the same time mm-hmm. because I know that like certain shit is gonna do or um, 
what reaction means to do more of what or you know right. type shit. Okay. Y'all like Plus, looking in their eyes when you suck a dick. Okay. Yeah. I close my eyes when y'all look at me. I absolutely eyes. tell you to look at me. Yeah. Like you yes. Yes. I like getting back into the arch position. I like I like being in a position yes. like I'm getting fucked <laughs> <somebody back. laughs> while I'm, I will squirt while I'm giving so, it. Period. Like, really? Like, yeah, Ooh. that's how much I look. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, so I will while I'm here. That's what I wanted to actually get into next, which is What's your favorite position to be in while giving head? Oh Jasmine's goodness. so short, I'm assuming it's standing up. <laughs> no, I like laying down. Okay. I like laying down doing it. But I feel like a lot of men like to be standing up. Mm. I don't. Is that no, true? I like to lay down. Really? Yeah, I prefer to lay down. If I'm laying down, that means you might eat my ass. Does increase the chances. Does increase the chances. I need to stand up right now. I'm like, uh, okay. My goal in life, life is to do the Captain Morgan. Have somebody giving me head <laughs> like the, 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 while I'm getting my ass ate. Mm. Oh, Foot oh, on the yeah. Okay, that's what that's called. Somebody told me that on this show. Uh, okay. Shout out to Suge. It was a long time ago. Oh, he told Shug. me that, and uh, he told me that he's like, "Oh, so you you want to get the Captain Morgan?" I'm like, "What, nigga? For sure. The fuck okay. is that?" I mean, that's how he's standing on the, the bottom. Yeah, he's like, like once he put it, I'm like, "Cause I ain't had rum in years, nigga." Like, um, Ashley, what did you say? How do you like to suck dick? Um, I think my favorite position, you know, he said, how do you like to come from squirting? No, no, no. no. How do you Whoa. like to suck dick? <laughs> <laughs> he said that too, though. Yeah, yeah. He said position while squirting, didn't he? No, no. 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 He said that as well. Five See, her own world. That's also a good yeah. question, though. She horny and fried. Okay. <laughs> Both no, 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 I'm actually good. My bad. I'm just like listening to all of y'all at the same time. This is new for me. This is my first time on the podcast. Oh, she yeah, so is. I'm just like trying to listen to everybody. But what when my favorite position on, is? Yeah. yeah. Um, hmm. You look like a near. You know, <laughs> like I would say squat, but I also like to be in the arch position. Can you like, show us I'm, how you would squat to give it? I mean, yeah, like you're so funny. Like, <laughs> like just in a normal squat. Like, you are just funny. <laughs> Just in the normal squat. She got, it's the hands for me. How long can you get hair like this? I mean, she got good knees. Yeah, like, I mean. Can I tell you something you not taking in a disrespectful way? I'm not going to take it in a disrespectful way. I am fried. Uh But you definitely look like the principal from Abbott Elementary. (laughs) Oh, shit. What is her name? Ava. Uh, Ava uh, Cole? Yes. I don't know. I I think that's her name in the show. I I think that's her name in the show. Okay, yeah. Ava, yes, she look like, pull her up. She not ugly. Period. Hold on. Okay. She no, just no, like you not ugly. You cute. Yeah, thank you. This is cool. Thank you. So, you know what I didn't talk about the last episode? Y'all ever been a part of group sex? You ever been a part of group yeah. sex? So, never mind. I'm not gonna talk about it. Wow. Why? I'm too fucking with y'all. So, yeah. would you be a part of group? Sex? I know. I know. Me and Josh would. What? Jasmine, would you be a part of group sex again? I've never been a part of group sex, but um, I mean, I'm open to it. I be feeling like I missed that stage in you life. Like Why no, is you it a stage? It's I don't 80 know. Year old I'm 32. I got an 11 year old. I'm like, yeah. man, you, you missed some fun days. Most, yeah. For the viewers, most that's fucking, just a bunch of people fucking in the room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and most hedonism, like, Plot or not plazas like with like resorts and shit mm-hmm. is old white people. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's old black people too, but mostly old white You've people. Been no, I stayed at the resort beside one, so I'm planning to go back. Mm. To, I want to go to the hedonism resort for my bachelorette. When you plan on getting proposed to? As soon as I get that threesome. <laughs> okay. Jazz, you said you free, right? <laughs> Let's no, they are a cute couple though. Y'all are. Yeah. She's like, I mean, I'll put it out there. I mean, this is what I'm saying. Y'all did me. I, you know. Y'all made me a threesome this next thing. So, let me ask you this. If y'all had a threesome, right? Yeah. Who I'm very is the verse. focal point. You, Josh, Nerdia, or the third? I like for it to be super fluid because I'm mm-hmm. super verse. So, like. Are you okay with the third being a focal point? Yeah. So, what I think is weird about when women talk about threesomes is, or even men. Why can't the new you you why everybody watch Toy Story right? Right. Why can't the new toy be the focal point? Because it's a new toy. Why d- doesn't everybody focus on that's how I would prefer it to be? Toy yeah, that's how I prefer it to be. Because this new pussy to me. Yeah. No, this is bad, but I didn't have this before. Yeah. Yeah. I know I didn't have it yesterday. I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna actually use this toy on this toy type shit. Like, you notice that they ignoring us about the toy sex. Yeah. I'm listening because I'm the focal point. Yeah. Okay. They they like we don't give a fuck because we. We don't want that bitch to be the focal point, so we gonna ignore what they talking about. Yeah. You cool if you had a sec a threesome sorry, with Josh? If you was not the, the focal point, if I'm not the focal point, yeah, yeah, I 
I enjoy sex, period. What would you do? And doing? I like watching, too. So I'm like, I don't really have to even be involved the whole time. So, so I want every, the, like, the thing that I really love about group sex is that it provides like a moment for you to take a break. Mm. <laughs> when I say group sex, do y'all mean like it can more. be threesome, four threesome, some, more. five, five six. anybody. What's the largest amount of people that's been involved with you nerdy and group sex? I think four. Four? Yeah. Three girls, one guy, or double double? It was five. And it was um three girls, two dudes. So did you technically get a MMF? partially in this group sex nah cause it was kind of like the dude stayed pretty split mm. so it's no like, I don't wanna be near that nigga dick okay. <laughs> energy pretty okay. much yeah okay. yeah yeah so have you had group sex this year yes really tell us a story um they're really sweet I like them still fuck with them to this day shout out to them um but me and the guy I think met on hinge mm. um and Masters. then he was fine as fuck. We both had like some poly shit in our description thing. Mm. So then we got to talking and then we met up and then we fucked and then we started talking more and obviously started talking about how we like poly shit and how I like women and blah, blah, blah. blah. And then uh, he introduced me to his homie, um, this girl, and love her down. Shout out to her as well. And then we all just got super cool. And I think she came out for. Maybe her birthday or mm. something because it was in Miami, mm. and we all like went out one night, um, had a bomb ass time, high as fuck because they're both smokers as well. Love smokers down, um, and then we just got fucking to it, and it was so mm. amazing. It was so amazing, and it was it lasted like two and a half days. It was great. Mm. Wow, it was amazing. Did you eat her ass? I think so. Mm. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Mm-hmm. On a scale of 1 to 10, how good do you think you eat pussy? Oh, it's an 11 for sure. Damn. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm not lying. <laughs> if she would have said, what do you think it is? I would have said an 11. <laughs> like, if she was to eat my wife pussy, I'd say, take it a little easy or write down what you did. <laughs> right, right, right. That's all I'm saying. You can feel it. Yeah. You can feel everything that she needs to tell you in your mouth. Now, you know what's like, funny? Like, listen and react. Yeah. I feel like... Between Ashley and Jazz, if mm-hmm. I had to pick who would be good at eating pussy the first time, okay, who would you pick? I'll tell you who I would pick. But who would you pick? <laughs> so the first time, yep. Between, remember they never Damn. did anything. Okay. Oh shit! No, but I thought you didn't. You didn't no. have it either. No. Nope. <gasps> oh shit! Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now it's more interesting. I feel okay, like on three bit. wheels. Yep, that's who I was going with. <laughs> hey, I was on your side, why? Jazz. I'm over here like, no, no, I'm going to tell you I why. Feel like I'm on your side. I feel like Jazz would be a little hesitant. And Ashley be like, well, I'm here. And since I'm here, I'm going to just do what I like. And mm-hmm. if she don't like it, she can tell me what she like and I'm down. Mm-hmm. I feel like Jazz would be like... My thing is, I just feel like I don't, even though I know how I like my pussy ate and all mm-hmm. that, I don't feel like I would know how to give a girl head. Like, mm-hmm. I think you can give a girl head. I think so, too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. As well. You got the thick tongue for it. For sure. And that matters. I don't know. It your just depends good. on, like, your comfortability. See, look at that. Now, you yes. really got a booty hole looking tongue. Respect. What does that this mean? Nigga his ass <laughs> ate tonight. I do. That's a gross misuse of your talents, man. So, wait, who See. was you going to pick? I was going to pick you. Oh. Wow. Just because you say you like more passionate type of mm. like, so I feel like once you got into it, like mm. once you got some good oh, feedback, yeah, for some sure. reaction, for sure, yeah, you probably turn mm-hmm. up. Yeah. All right, I feel so like you were just diving. Where we at, Trev? I'm definitely if I'm there. Hour. Like, All right, so we going we hour. only gonna do one thing. I'm gonna bring up this uh, story. Be fried, uh, and I'm gonna see what y'all say about this. Okay. Um, and we are gonna end the show. Right. Is men right. blocking women on social media sassy? <coughs> Just say yes or no. Don't give any additional content. We're going to start with jazz and wrap it all the way around the room. You said just the me. answer, but not yep. why? Yep. No. No. Nah. I think it is. Damn, protect your peace, King. <laughs> wow. Did you read what I put or something? I literally no. said, why is it an issue with men protecting their peace? But for real, though. That's yeah. just, this is more so like my view on social media in general. Like, me personally... This is my personal opinion. I don't. I won't block anybody. Yeah, you have to literally be shit. harassing me. That's what I'm for saying. Me to block for me to head. block you, but I don't. Somebody, a dude, funny, a nigga on Twitter, like told me he blocked a dude that was like annoying us. Like we were having a conversation, and somehow 
I don't know, somebody retweeted it and this random nigga just jumped into the conversation. Mm-hmm. Neither of us shared mutual follows with this dude or anything. Mm-hmm. And I was like, bro, did you block that nigga? He's like, yeah. I was like, I'm about to block him because that shit was weird. Like, yeah. yeah. It, and That's I was just like, protect your peace because why am I listening to that? Yeah. Yeah. So mm-hmm. then I was thinking about, like, example. Women say a nigga is gay if he argues with a woman on social media in front of everybody, right? Yeah, but then if a nigga blocks him, that's how is he being yeah. sassy? Like, yeah. which one is it? Yeah. You know, okay. I'm blocking this bitch because I don't want to hear what she got to say, and I don't, I don't want y'all hitting me with I'm arguing with a bitch on social media. You know, yeah. to me, if I'm a, I don't think anybody should get down to a straight up argument on social media. But Nothing. if we're gonna play devil's advocate mm-hmm. to play it fair, I don't think the argument being with a man or a woman differentiates that shit unless it gets to conversations of being physical. If we're having an argument, me arguing with a man or a woman about blah 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 it shouldn't matter about the sex it should all be even but if we're gonna break it down to that why not block that person so you can just ignore that mm-hmm. i think it's weird I, in, a, in a i know this is gonna sound dramatic but i think in a sense we eliminate avenues and options for black men to actually take a deep breath and do mm-hmm. things for themselves and we take away mm-hmm. all of those options yeah like a nigga can't get his ass ate without being gay a nigga can't block a motherfucker without being gay you know, Jasmine can't peg a nigga without the nigga she pegged being gay. Do you mm. think niggas that get pegged is good? Um, no, but that's Took not something that long. I. No, it's just not something that I would participate in. But that don't. Um, mm. I mean, if you got a woman doing that, it's whatever. It's to each his own. I don't even understand why niggas care about what people do. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Like, you, this is why they care. Them. This is why they care. I hear it every day. Mm. We, and. and I, I will say that I hear more from women. I'm not saying that that's the case in life. That's just my experience. But women say, I don't care that they do that, but I wouldn't date them. So to me, you do care because you wouldn't date them because they do that. Right. Especially if that's the sole reason that you wouldn't date them. Like, uh, I wouldn't on, date that guy because he sucked a dick 10 years ago. Mm. To me. What if he was trying to rule out his options? Like, trying yeah. to find out what he don't like. Yes. And, you know, <laughs> 10 years ago, like, that's just kind of weird to me. Yeah. Especially in a monogamous relationship to go back to what I you said. You said the beginning. dick before? No. But I'm definitely would one of those you? girls that would say no. that. Like, <laughs> would I, you? I, I would, I'm Not definitely one of those girls, like just being raw, I'm definitely one of those girls that would say that. So, but I feel what you're saying. But I mean just being accountable. It's just but saying, at I'm the one same of those time, girls that have said it was. Are like, you one of those girls that would be mad if a nigga lied at, lied to you? I would, but I, I would, would be see, more I would upset res- if they I would lied more, about be, it. Yeah, I would but to me, that's more that contradiction. I would respect the fact that he told me the truth, but just let me, you know. Let me have my decision. choice. Yeah. I get what you're saying, but I'm playing devil's advocate, right? Devil you don't say, know. let me pick this truth, but mm-hmm. your truth doesn't even matter. I'm not saying that to be an asshole. Why? Your truth doesn't matter if a nigga sucked dick 10 years ago and you want to be in a monogamous relationship. Why do it matter? He might as well lie to you because you wouldn't even talk to him. That could be mm. the man that God gave you because he sucked a dick 10 years ago. You won't talk to him. So why wouldn't he lie? <laughs> no, I'm niggas had their preference, I, I though. Like, from your perspective, you're like, he might as well lie because you know he wouldn't, you wouldn't go for the shit. If but that's how niggas truth. think. But if somebody did tell me that truth and that's not what I wanted, then we just weren't meant to be. Because mm-hmm. I feel like whatever it's meant to be will always be. So if, if that's just what causes us not to be, that means we wasn't Let's meant to be Let's be real. Place. As humans, we always put our fucking foot in our mouths and fuck up shit that's meant to be for us. Can mm-hmm. you put your foot in your mouth? Well, I disagree with that. To be, it's just redirection at the end of the day. Because, I mean, if it, if you're going right or left at mm-hmm. the end of the day, you're going to make it to the destination. So it's never get. something yeah, that y'all feel like y'all respect. missed out that was meant for y'all because y'all fucked up? No, nah, it was a good ass reason I ain't get that shit. <laughs> yeah, even if I didn't understand, even it, if it was at that something time, small, I understood yeah. it at one point in life. Mm-hmm. Like, no, nah. exactly. It can be something like fucking five years ago. I'll be like, oh yeah, shit, that's why that happened. That's like that. why that shit yeah. happened mm-hmm. like this. Like actually yeah. happening, especially I right now that I'm being back in the city. Yes, like nigga, every time I see smoke, I be thinking the building on fire. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look, this episode been a great on fire. Episode. It is. This, <laughs> this is a dope ass episode. All right, I want everybody to say that they gonna suck dick or eat pussy tonight. I would like Jazz? to. Jazz, I'm trying to for sure. All right, cool. <laughs> you gonna exchange numbers uh, after the show? Yeah, these were awesome, cool individuals. See, somebody <laughs> gonna get something eight. Look, wow. this has been a great episode of Cocktails with Cocktails. I appreciate all y'all. Alessa, we miss you. Uh, I want you to eat some ass. Uh, I know when we better. talked earlier, you said your your nails is off, so I hope you finger pop after COVID. And hey, this is dope. <laughs> Uh, yeah, right there. Uh, <laughs> I'm fried. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, that wow. All right, we, yeah. all right, we gotta have all four of y'all on the couch. 
picture. Oh, for a picture? Yeah. You can make it work? You could just sit 